Welcome back guys to this special video where we are going to unlock the secrets to scoring 60 on 60 in your KCET 2024 physics exam. Yes guys, you heard it right. And if you don't know me, I am Darshan and I am currently pursuing my second year of engineering in JCSSTU Mysore through KCET 2022 exam. KCET physics can be a challenging task for many of you, but with the right roadmap, dedication and resources, I am sure that you can conquer it guys. In this video, we are going to outline the best roadmap to success in KCET physics. We will discuss the essential chapters which you need to master, recommend the best study resources and YouTube channels and provide you with expert tips that will help you not only score well but also truly understand the concepts of physics which are really really interesting guys. Hit that subscribe button to never miss out any informative video like this and make sure that you watch this video till the end cause I don't want you to miss any of the takeaways which I'll be providing you in this video in the later part. And before starting this video, I have a good news for all the KCET 2024 aspirants out there. I have seen a lot of KCET aspirants who will be ready to give all the hard work which the preparation takes but we'll be missing out on the best resources and a structured plan to go about with their KCET preparation. And this is where I personally feel that PW's Sartak KCET fast track batch can prove to be a game changer in your KCET preparation guys. I was just going through this course and I was really fascinated to see how good and how experienced these teachers are and to see the plan laid out by them to complete the KCET syllabus in a stipulated amount of time. It's really good guys. Here you'll be getting recorded lectures in both English and Kannada by the best and experienced faculties in India. You all know the importance of solving PYQs in exams such as KCET and for that reason one live PYQs discussion class will be provided weekly and you'll also be getting DPPs with video solutions. DPPs stands for daily practice problems and here you'll be getting a set of problems each and every day which will help you regularize your practice and in the same way maintain the consistent hard work which you are putting in in order to get a seat in your dream college and the pdf notes of all lectures will be provided along with the lecture so that you can just revise off the entire lecture once you complete watching it you all know that attending mock tests is a game changer for exams like kcet and for that reason mock tests will also be there to improve your performance in the final exam and you'll get detailed test analysis to increase your understanding and then there will also be dedicated doubt engine where all your doubts will be resolved. Along with that, the peer-to-peer -peer doubt support will also be available for this batch, which is again a game changer, guys. Best part is that you can get all of these at a discounted price of rupees 1,799 instead of rupees 2,499. You can also use the code which is being displayed on the screen to get extra rupees 150 off on your registration, guys. So what are you waiting for? Hurry up and you can just click the link which I have given in the description to join the batch and take your KCET 2024 preparation to the next level with Physics Wala. Now talking about an ideal roadmap to tackle your physics part of KCET exam. The remaining uh, time available in front of you is around roughly 7 months and in that what I would suggest you is to complete the entire physics syllabus in roughly 150 days yes guys this spans to around five months and i want you guys to complete the entire syllabus of physics at least once by around uh, mid february and this includes both the 11th part and the 12th part and you can just revise off the 11th part along with your 12th uh, boards preparation which you are doing now and with that i think you should be completing the syllabus at least once till mid february completing the syllabus doesn't mean you should be expert in each and every chapter but still once you should be uh, having a hold on all the chapters which comes under the syllabus and talking about your current situation even if you are someone who is starting from now on it's completely fine and you can do wonders if you start now guys and if you are if you ask me the question about how to start and from which chapters to start i have got you covered because here i have curated a list in which i have divided the chapters which come under your physics into easy moderate and a kind of uh, time consuming chapters you can just take a screenshot of it if you need and the thing is you should be going in an order from easy to moderate to time consuming around March 2024 you should be able to figure out the chapters which carry high weightage in your KCET and for that reason I have already uploaded a video in which I have deeply discussed about the chapter wise weightage when it comes to physics you can just watch it if you want starting off with easy chapters will give you a great confidence which will help you uh, tackle moderate and a kind of tough chapters too then 
moving on to the most time consuming chapters or uh, considerably large chapters in your physics syllabus that is rotational motion oscillations and waves optics so these are chapters which are uh, kind of large and which consume a lot of time in order to digest in order to understand each and every concept present over there so understanding that i have put these chapters in this particular category and i want you to invest a lot of time in this so uh, you would have saved a lot of time in completing easy and moderate chapters because that doesn't require a lot of time now is the time to give a lot of time invest a lot of time in this time consuming chapters and uh, to strengthen yourself in these particular concepts because these chapters which are considered to be hard carry a decent weightage in your kct exam yes guys optics kinematics and rotational motion these carry a huge weightage when it comes to your kct exam so keep that in mind while preparing and it is completely fine if these particular chapters consume a little bit more time than expected and now once we discuss all the chapters which are present in our syllabus for kct 2024 exam now the biggest question which should be coming in your mind is how to complete a chapter how i mean when should i say that i have completed a particular chapter so for this question i had shared this sequence in my previous video too where i had discussed about a uh, game plan or a uh, roadmap to utilize this seven months effectively yes guys this is the sequence i followed for physics during my time and uh, this has worked for me and for many students who followed this during kct 2023 too so that is the reason why i'm sharing with I'm sharing it with all the experience which I have got. One of the important questions which people ask me is that, okay, bro, we complete a chapter, we uh, watch a lecture, we make our notes, we revise off everything, we write all the formulas in a separate sheet, we uh, kind of uh, memorize each and every formula. But then we wo we aren't in a position to solve questions. We, I mean, the questions are not getting solved by us. So what should we do in this particular situation? Guys, I always tell this to my juniors or uh, people who uh, consult me regarding the preparation it is completely fine if you are not in a position to solve questions after you complete your lecture after you complete any chapter the exercise is simple take a question try solving it try all the ways through which you can reach to the final answer if not then go through the solution and then then is the important task of revisiting that question again and doing that by your own so this well, trust me guys this really helps because uh, this is one thing which has helped me personally. Yeah, Physics Galaxy, Physics Wala, Unacademy Need Toppers and PW Canada. These are channels which you can refer. First two channels, uh, the content is in Hindi and talking about Unacademy Need Toppers, Gaurav Gupta sir is really amazing guys. You will be, I mean, he'll take you to an entire different world of physics where you'll understand everything very, very easily. So that is one, I mean, that is the reason why I kept it over there. You can just refer it out and then if you are someone who wants to watch lectures in Canada, then uh, Physics Wala Canada is a YouTube channel which is coming up with uh, content for KCT completely in Canada. So you can just go through it. You can just go through all these channels. NCRT in the sense, you can just go through the in-text questions and the exercise questions because there are instances wherein questions are directly being picked from NCRT for your KCT exam. That is the reason why I'm telling you, even if the content is uh, kind of very much concise over there, very much difficult to understand over there, the questions which are there as part of in-text questions and exercise, the questions are really good and really relevant when it comes to your KCAT guys. But still, uh, NCRT at your fingertips by MTG Publications. It is a really good book guys. I kind of admire that particular book a lot because everything is given in a structured manner and questions are also very much relevant to the entrance examinations of uh, the present. And then the third book which you can prefer is the 15 years KCET previous year questions or previous year solved papers through which you will be getting an idea of how questions are appearing in KCET or you'll be getting to uh, you'll be getting that hands-on experience of solving a KCET paper by yourself while preparing. So this was it guys. So once you complete this video, now is the time to understand all the positive takeaways which you can take from this video and which you can inculcate during your preparation which will definitely help you succeed in KCET physics guys. I'm pretty sure that all of you are equally capable of excelling in KCET 2024 physics. If you are someone who is strictly following whatever I told you in this video or if you are someone who is really uh, serious about your preparation for uh, KCET, especially the physics part, I'm sure you'll definitely excel in it. I enjoyed a lot while I was sharing these things about uh, how to maximize your uh, KCET 2024 physics preparation in this entire video guys. If you did the same, then make sure that you hit the like button cause that will give me a lot of motivation moving forward. 
and if you need the same kind of video for chemistry or for biology or for mathematics for that reason make sure that you put it in the comment section so that i'll be able to come up with those videos in the coming future and i'm planning of uploading a lot of videos like this on kct 2024 preparation so to never miss out on that i would request you to subscribe to my channel so that you will you'll be getting notified as soon as i upload any kind of new video guys so with that note uh, thank you guys thank you for watching this video till the end uh, we'll meet in the next video bye